What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna guide you through the columns usage in WordPress websites. So we're gonna teach you how to use columns in three different page building editors. The Gutenberg new in WordPress 5 update, the Bakery page builder or formerly Visual Composer and the Elementor page builder. As you can see down here, we have a title and a text description, but you can add any other layout you can imagine in the columns and use it to improve the design that you want. First of all, let me use the Gutenberg editor. Click in this plus button, select columns, and it will auto generate you two columns so you can enter with your test. Let me preview, and you can see two columns. Let me delete this test and using the plus button, add an image so we can change a bit the design and create something. As you can not inside the columns, you can apply your content to change the design and create new ones. Let me add some space on it. Once again, using the plus button, we're gonna add a heading for maybe a section title. Perfect. Now that you have the idea of what you can create using columns on your WordPress, let me do the same process, but using another page builder in here, the WP Bakery Page Builder. In this plugin, you can use both backend or frontend editor. Let me use the backend. You can click on the plus button or add element button, raw, and in the raw, you will not see a lot of column layouts pre-built and a, a custom option where you can design your own layout. Let me use the default one health and one health. By clicking in the plus button in each of the columns that you created, you will be able to open the elements list to create and add other elements to the column layout. Let me use the raw settings to add some space. We have a guide about spacing usage in Bakery Page Builder. I will leave the link in the description below and a card over here.
as you can see, using the Bakery Page Builder, you can play with space. And columns gap to change the separation between columns. Let me align all to the middle. And we made it. Once we get it with Bakery Page Builder, let me proceed the same using the Elementor Page Builder WordPress plugin. As soon as you open the Jifu editor, click on Elementor so you can load the plugin options and add new section. By clicking in the plus button, you'll be able to select the columns layout that you want and just add drag and drop elements in the layout. Once all the Visual Model WordPress themes are fully compatible with page building plugins, you can choose the one that you like and enjoy the columns layout to unleash your imagination and create your desired layout. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, come here back later for more. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question and all the best!